Some scientists now believe that the universe never had a true beginning. If proven true, this could become one of the most compelling pieces of evidence that we live in a simulated world. It sounds impossible because if everything must begin somewhere, how can reality itself have no beginning? In this video, we'll explore the latest and strangest scientific theories that suggest the universe never truly began and how this might confirm that our reality is in fact an artificial design. In 1964, scientists Arno Penzias and Robert Wilson stumbled upon a faint radio hiss, a sound that seemed to come from every direction in space. That sound turned out to be the cosmic microwave background, also known as CMB, the fading echo of the Big Bang itself. For decades, we thought the Big Bang was the exact moment our universe was created. However, what this faint radio hiss later revealed shattered everything we thought we knew about the creation itself. In 2010, physicist Roger Penrose found a strange circular pattern embedded in the cosmic microwave background. This was very strange finding because the CMB was the first signal ever released by our universe. It should be perfectly smooth, untouched, yet somehow it was already disturbed, as if the Big Bang was never the beginning of our universe at all, only a continuation of what came before. After his discovery and further research, Penrose proposed an impossible idea, that the universe never truly began, but has always been in motion for eternity. Penrose's conformal cyclic cosmology theory suggests the universe has no beginning or end, only one huge continuous reality changing form again and again. Black holes slowly evaporate, stars burn out, until everything becomes uniform, a cold, silent sea of encoded information. And then, somehow, it begins again, not through a new explosion, but through a seamless transition. It simply resets the stage over and over forever. But how could that be? How can reality exist with no starting point? That doesn't make any sense at all. Our minds were never built to picture a world without beginnings. It's as if an imagination just hit the edge of the universe and could it go any further. Unless we've been trying to find the beginning in the wrong place. What if the reason our universe had no true beginning is because it isn't the real universe at all? Think of it like a game stored on a Blu-ray disc, frozen, complete, waiting to be played. If the characters inside that game ever asked what was there before the game began, it would be an impossible question because time for them only exists the moment the game starts to play. Before that, there was no time at all. There was no before. Therefore, it would be impossible to give any meaningful answer. But does that mean there was nothing before? No. The game, the characters, the story, the entire timeline was always there, written, complete, just waiting for someone to load it. And maybe that's why we can't see when the universe began, because the beginning didn't happen here. It happened before the time ever began.
But that raises a difficult question. When the creator finished scripting the game, wouldn't that mark the beginning of our universe? Let me ask you a question. If we ever create a simulation, a digital world with rules, characters, and time, would we be creating a separate universe? Or would we be building an artificial world inside a much larger one, inside ours? When the simulated world loads, its inhabitants might search for a beginning, measure time, invent theories, but no matter how far back they trace their timeline, they'll never find the true beginning. Because their world didn't begin inside their world, it began outside of it. Maybe that's why we can't find the beginning of our own universe, because the true beginning never happened here. It happened out there. But if our universe never had a beginning, what does that say about us? We think we began the moment we were conceived, but what if consciousness works the same way the universe does? Not created, not destroyed, only transformed. Maybe that's why some people remember moments from lives they never lived. Maybe that's why some moments feel like a deja vu, as if we've lived them before. If the universe has no beginning, maybe neither do we. Hey, thank you so much for staying with me till the end. If you found this video interesting, I'd suggest watching this one next. It dives into some of the strongest evidence yet that reality might be a simulation. And if you enjoy discovering strange anomalies and hidden facts, you can now join the Beyond Meaning email list where I share discoveries and weird findings from my research that never make it into the videos. Think of it as an extension of every story I release here on YouTube. The links are in the description, so feel free to join. And again, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Take care.